Hey YouTube, uh, I bought this Kevlar uh, sleeve from Amazon. Uh, there came in a pack of uh, three pairs for I think it was twenty bucks. This is the uh, tag that was on the sleeve. It's from uh, Dupont Kevlar, so you know it's. You know, quality material, but when I got it, I was I was testing it with a knife. You know, trying to trying to uh, trying to cut it. You know, I wanted to test it, test it out here, to see if it you know if it holds up to its uh, to its rating here. I'm putting pressure on this. You know, you're not getting much there from from pressure, but uh, so you can see it's good for it's good for small blades with not so much leverage. But uh, I wanted to see and this is this is two ply. It's it's basically one tube, one that's been folded onto its into itself. And then stitched at the end, so it's it's two two ply here. But then I figured I wanted to to test it out and see how it how it holds up against something with a little bit more leverage and see if it would prevent uh, you know damage from a machete. So you know you're wearing this on your forearm, and you know if you accidentally take a machete blow to the to the forearm, would it you know? Would it prevent you from uh, getting your your hand cut off, basically? But unfortunately, it would not would not hold up well in that type of uh, situation. And uh, as you can see, I didn't put much force into the swing of the machete. It just uh, and this is this is just a regular uh, Tremontina. Uh, machete no no extra um you know sharpening i didn't sharpen it or anything it's just factory just like that and uh i mean you'll see i i don't i don't swing it hard like you know like what would normally be the case if someone was swinging this i just kind of tap it you know and it, and it broke it broke the uh so you know if someone is swinging this full force and you've got and you've got this, uh, and you've got this little uh, piece of Kevlar on your forearm. Uh, it's not going to really help much for that. So uh, you know, for that kind of leverage and force, no. Uh, something with that kind of kinetic energy would definitely go straight through the uh, straight through the uh, sleeve. But a little, a little knife, you know. Uh, slash like this, uh, no, you know you're you're protected from this kind of stuff. But uh, you know, and I and I've got a buddy that uh, he welds, and so I gave him uh, a pair of these tubes, uh, these sleeves. So we're gonna see, you know, after a couple weeks he, of him using it, uh, we'll see if it prevents uh, splash from the from the weld. And everything if it if it you know protects his wrist from that but there you go you can see it, it's it's good against uh, against small knives uh, it's not good against it's not puncture resistant obviously but uh, it's good against small knives and uh, possibly uh, you know heat and splash from a from a welder uh, from welding but uh, as far as uh, something with more leverage uh, a little bit more kinetic energy, like a machete. Uh, it's it's kind of pointless. It's it, it wouldn't uh, wouldn't wouldn't help much against something like that. So there you go. I just thought I'd do a quick review on the uh, G and F products Kevlar sleeve. Thanks for watching.